I got a request now. Um, somebody was working on the Affinity Designer and the panels just disappeared on the sides here. And the way to get it back is to go to Window under Studio. You'll see here there's Show Left Panel and Show Right Panel. And those are unchecked. That's why you're not seeing anything there. So if we go to Show Left Studio, you'll see nothing here because by default, the default setting is all the panels are on the right. So if we go to Studio again and we say Show Right Panels, there we have everything over there. Okay, so that's how you get to show it. But in addition to that, anybody who's watched my videos will know that I use my Layers panel here on the left. Now, if this thing is reset, then it's constantly going to jump over. But I might want certain arrangements. I don't want the swatches to be here. I want it to be next to my stroke. And in this case, yeah, I might want to have styles as the dominant thing. So what, whatever your settings are, your arrangement are, you can set your things out and save it as a preset. Okay, so how do you do that? I've just set this now. I'm going to go and color. And remember, whatever's showing up here is going to be what's saved as the preset's default. When you click on it, that's what's going to show. So in a case like this, um, I'm going to go, my usual is I'm going to go in here and where do we go to stock images? Okay, so I want stock there. I'm going to drag it over here and I make that my dominant one over there. So stock must be in that space. Stock there, color, stroke, and yeah, swatches. I don't particularly use swatches that much. I'll just close that off. So say this is my layout. I can go to Windows Studio and add this as a preset. Okay, so remember whatever is showing here in this palette, being on the right and on the left, whatever is showing up here will be exactly like it is. So if I go add preset, RT dash, uh, let's call that default. Okay, so I'm going to just go back here and show you that if we look at the bottom here, we can hide these panels, but this is a temporary measure. You can go Shift H and Shift H to bring them back again. So let me just show you that if I click Shift H, they disappear. Press Shift H, they come back again. The one right at the bottom here is to reset the studio to the default. Now I've saved all of these things into my default. My, I've just called it RT default, but the computer, the program itself has its standard reset default. So if I click here, all of the things are going to shift to what it was originally. If I click there, can you see it comes? Color swatches come back, the layers come into the side. If I go and I click here and I click RT default, which is the one I created, you'll see the color stroke, the swatches disappeared because I removed it. Here we have stock images and my layers on the side. Okay, so this really, really cool feature. If you got different layouts, you can save them as different setups over here and give them names. And then of course, if you want to manage those presets, if you want to remove some of them, or do things to them, you can come into this management panel. But for the most, I think if these panels just disappear, know that it's it's probably a setting like that. But you might have, instead of you know pressing some other shortcut key, you might have gone Shift H and then this thing disappears. If you go here and you go look here, you're not going to see anything specifically looking at you unless you go and look and see Hide Studio is checked. Okay, you can press Shift H again. So Shift H to hide and Shift H to unhide. Hopefully that helps you and get you out of a dilemma of looking for your panels one day. Be blessed and have a fantastic day. Shalom to everybody.